Zoom out, demystified. Understanding the phrase. Hello everyone. Today, we're diving deep into a commonly used phrase in English, zoom out. By the end of this video, you'll understand what it means, where it comes from, and how to use it in various contexts. Let's get started. The term, zoom, originally comes from photography and cinematography. Photographers and filmmakers use zoom lenses to get closer to or farther away from a subject without physically moving the camera. When you, zoom in, you get a closer view. Conversely, when you, zoom out, you get a broader, more distant view. When you, zoom out, in a literal sense, like on a digital device or camera, you're making the image or content smaller, allowing you to see more of the surrounding area. Imagine you're looking at a map on your phone. When you zoom out, you can see more cities or even entire countries, but the details become smaller. Now, zoom out isn't just limited to photography or technology. It's also used figuratively in everyday conversations. When someone says, let's zoom out for a moment, they're essentially suggesting that you take a step back and look at the bigger picture. They want to shift the focus from tiny details to a more comprehensive view or perspective on a situation. Examples 1. When discussing a problem, we've been focusing on this tiny issue for hours. Let's zoom out and think about the broader implications. 2. In strategic planning, to understand our company's position in the market, we need to zoom out and analyze the industry as a whole. 1. Context is key. Before using, zoom out, make sure it fits the situation. If you're talking about a picture or map, it's literal. If you're discussing a broader perspective, it's figurative. 2. Pair it up. You can use, zoom out, in conjunction with, zoom in, to contrast focusing on details versus the bigger picture. 3. Keep it clear. If you're unsure whether your audience will understand the figurative sense, clarify it. For instance, let's zoom out. I mean, let's look at the bigger picture here. And that's a wrap on the phrase, zoom out. Whether you're discussing photos, digital content, or life's broader perspectives, this is a versatile term to keep in your English vocabulary arsenal. We hope you found this explainer helpful, and next time you hear or use, zoom out, you'll do so with confidence. Happy learning, and see you in the next video.